Welcome to Teacher K's English Bite of the Week. Today we will take a brief look at the difference between an idiom and a proverb. In Malaysia, where I live, proverbs are often included in the UPSR English exam, but some people call them idioms. So what is the difference between an idiom and a proverb? An idiom is usually a short phrase, but not a complete sentence. It is included within a longer sentence. For example, out of work means that you are not working. My uncle is out of work. My uncle is not working. Another idiom is flat broke. This means that you do not have any money. I can't go to the restaurant because I'm flat broke. I can't go to the restaurant because I do not have any money. Another example is to catch someone's eye. Catch someone's eye means to attract attention. The beautiful actress caught his eye. The beautiful actress caught his attention. Cry your eyes out means cry for a very long time. When he left, she cried her eyes out. When he left, she cried for a very long time. Proverbs, on the other hand, are full sentences that have a specific meaning. Proverbs are usually what you will find on the UPSR exam. I do want to note that while many native speakers use idioms on a regular basis, proverbs, which were very popular in the past, are rarely used in everyday speech nowadays. For example, I found on last year's UPSR exam, time and tide wait for no man. This means that if you do not take advantage of an opportunity, it may never come again. I use this one occasionally. It's make hay while the sun shines. This means that you should take advantage of an opportunity to finish a task when you're able to. Don't wait. And sometimes I use that um, because people are saying, why are you working so hard? And I'll say, well, make hay while the sun shines. It means I'm working because I have the opportunity to do so. And another proverb, half a loaf is better than none. This means getting a little something is better than getting nothing at all. And the last proverb I want to share is many hands make light work. This means that people can do things more quickly and easily when they work together. So these few proverbs are proverbs that maybe you'll hear every once in a while, but they're not used as often as idioms. I hope this gives you a better understanding of everyday English speech. I will try to include idioms, proverbs, and other confusing English in this series, Teacher K's English Bite of the Week.